The theme of International Women's Day for 2022 is breaking the bias. Inspired by the Round Square ideals, at Newcastle Grammar School we are going beyond the bias to look at the possibilities for the future of women. My hope for all humans is that they have the freedom to show up as themselves, live their truth, dream big dreams, work hard to make them come true, and live a life of meaning, rich in all the emotions and experiences this beautiful world has to offer. I'd like young women to grow up feeling empowered that they can achieve anything that they want to achieve and not feel that they are in any way constrained by their gender. I hope in the future that we don't actually have to ask this question. Um, I hope that I don't have to think about whether my daughter feels that she is recognised or not recognised because of her gender. When I'm older I want to be a farmer because I love animals. When I'm older I want to be a doctor or a lawyer. I want to be a tech engineer because I like to work with tech. I would like to have a job that helps people. I want to be a doctor because I want to help people. I want to be a art teacher when I grow up because I love art. Art is just amazing for your brain and I just love it. My vision for women in the future is that it will be a safe place, it will be an inclusive place and there will be no barriers. So potential will be limitless and there will be no glass ceilings. My hope for the future is that no woman will ever have to face discrimination because of their gender. I want women to feel safe at night when they walk home alone. Um, when I'm older, I'd love to see a more diverse range of women in politics. I want all the young women that we teach to have the opportunity to see the world. In the future, I hope that women get to choose their own path and have equal rights. For me, they'll be becoming a musician. In the future, I want to see more women comfortable with themselves. I want to see normalisation of all body types. My wish is that for all girls, despite the diversity, that they have equal opportunities. In the future, I want to see more women in STEM. My hope for young women as they move through life is to always remain strong and independent and to back themselves in any situation, no matter how challenging it is, and to use their voice. I would love for a conversation about women to be one where we don't actually have to identify women as a gender, we can just talk about people. I want to be a hairdresser. I want to be a surgeon to help anyone who needs it. I want to be a teacher when I'm older because I love the thought of helping kids. What I want to be when I grow up is a vet. I want to be a farmer when I grow up. I want to be a sewer because I want to make clothes. I want to be a teacher because I want to help the next generation. I want to be a High Court judge in order to try and help um, promote rights regarding equality in Australia and hopefully do something with the UN to promote equality all over the world and internationally. In the future I hope to see more women and girls in sport just participating and believing in themselves to do whatever they want. I want to be a doctor because I want to help people. When I'm older I'd like to be a successful sport scientist. When I grow up I want to be a cardiologist or an actress. I'd like to be a scientist when I grow up because I love space. In terms of what I'd like to see in the future for women, first of all, a safe space for women. That's something that we still all struggle with today. We're all thinking about the biases and inherent assumptions we have about women that are so ingrained that um, they disturb how we act every single day. It's really hard to unpack these, so it's something that we should all be thinking about and conscious of as we step into every day and this is a role that we all have to play. It's not down to one person. I would love to be a female swim coach. It's a very male dominated profession. I'd love to encourage girls to swim more. I want to be a fashion designer or an architect. I want to be a physical therapist. Because, well, I want to fit people. When I grow up, I want to be a physiotherapist because I want to help people. When I grow up, I want to be a midwife so that I can help women. I want to be an international aid worker to help women who are struggling overseas. When I grow up, I want to be a psychologist to help people. When I grow up, I want to be a paleontologist because I love dinosaurs. 
When I grow up, I want to be a sports person and play netball to inspire other women. When I'm older, I want to be either a doctor to help people or an athlete to show people that they can be what they want to be. When I grow up, I want to be an artist or a therapist because I want to help people who feel troubled. In the future, I want to be a business owner because not many businesses are run by females, so I want to be one to show that females can do it too. When I grow up, I want to be a famous soccer player and also an architect because I love designing houses. I would like to be a dance teacher when I grow up because I love to dance and I love working with kids. I don't want the fact that I'm a woman of colour to hinder any of my decision making. I want to be a queen when I grow up. When I grow up, I want to be a face painter and a sewer. When I grow up, I want to be an author or an illustrator. For me, the future for women, it's really important that it's intersectional and that the conversation opens up to more than just the individual white female experience, but um, disabled women and women of colour um, and LGBTQ women, it's really important that when we're talking about feminism, we're including a whole range of different types of women. When I'm older, I would like to encourage other women and from like, no matter where they come from or no matter who they are, to show them that they can be whoever they want to be and they can make their dreams come true. I want a future for women where they can do everything, see everything and be everything. The future of women is, is such an important issue. Uh, it continues to be an important issue for everybody. Um, what I hope for women is that they have all of the opportunities that a wonderful education uh, provides to them and being in a, in a world that recognises that experiences and opportunities for everybody. Equality in pay, uh, equality in experience is so very important and at the heart of that is an education that supports equality, not just for women but for everybody. I want a future for women where women and men work incredibly effectively together and live together with respect and thoughtfulness and so that everybody feels that they have equal opportunity.